Hey everybody and welcome back to BeamNG Drive. But every time I crash, the RPM doubles. So this one turned out to be a lot harder to make than expected since I did have to dig deeper into BeamNG's code than I was comfortable with and I'll explain why later, but boy was it worth it. Because as you'll see, 100,000 RPM hits hard. Let's go. Quite literally. Uh but before we start turning our car into a vacuum cleaner, Grand <coughs> <and> Turismo, <coughs> Let me tell you a couple of things about it. This is a high-end Gabriel Roma, equipped with four-wheel drive and powered by 4.5 liters of American V8 muscle, which is the perfect car for your average soccer mom. In its stock form, the engine outputs 197 horsepower and redlines at 5,500 RPM, but it's safe to say that it is far from being able to sustain even 10,000 RPM without straight up melting. So of course, I had to make not only the engine, but the entire car high RPM proof. So thermodynamics, fuck you, and please welcome strong drive shaft, full obanium internals, and super lubed limited slip differentials. This truly is a work of art, and we're gonna drive it right now. So let me just reverse my way out of here. And as usual, we have AI driving around, but this time we have a lot more cars, as you may have noticed, so... <laughs> it's gonna be hard for me not to crash. Which you wouldn't say since I truly am one of the greatest drivers of all times. Of course, I can't drive like a grandma because, well, I'll never crash, even though elderly people do tend to cause quite the number of road accidents, but I am going to start driving like I've been needing to shit for the past seven hours. Not a crash. Also, we are going to go downhill now, so being an SUV, it's going to be hard not to crash. Look at the Ah, oh, shit. Not a crash, come on. So basically- He actually fell from the cliff. So I managed to exit the car, but... Where even is he? Man, I can't... Fuck. Anyways, let's not get bogged down, because we now have 11,000 RPM. So one thing I didn't mention at the start is that power is going to increase almost linearly. But actually, to be more precise, it's random as fuck. And in fact, we do now have... 566 horsepower. But the real question is, how does it sound? Let's find out. I'm not sure what I was expecting, but I kind of like it. Anyways, let's go. Holy shit. If it still drives, then we're good. I should stop driving like this. Anyways. <gasps> Come on, I'm trying to make a video, you fucking tic-tac looking boy. Okay, that's the last crash I'm counting as not a crash. Anyways, this is noticeably faster. But man, power isn't always the answer. So in this video, we're gonna reach some pretty high RPM numbers. But if you want to see even crazy figures, I'd strongly suggest checking out Forgotten Mustard's videos, which I've linked in the description. I still have absolutely no idea how he got those numbers. I tried, but yeah. And like the main problem is the updated oil and clutch physics, among other stuff. We're just gonna upgrade. So we now have an incredible 22,000 RPM, which doesn't even make sense. And this time the power did go up pretty linearly, giving us just shy of 1200 horsepower. But how does it sound? Not gonna lie, I am kind of scared. That's 11,000. We still have 11,000 more. <laughs> what the f- It does kind of sound like a vacuum cleaner now. Holy sh- I'm never gonna dump the clutch again. But yeah. Look at that drift. Nice. Observe how we overtake this supercar. Holy sh- I wanna drift it though. And that's why you don't drink and drive. I'm gonna push it here. <laughs> of course, of course. Y 
Yeah, bingo. How many cars did we hit? Holy f Yes. We have 44,000 RPM now. And I am really curious to see, or rather hear, how it sounds. I'm so confused right now. Is this a jet engine? What the f Yes, officer. It's stock. Yes? Bogdanov, it's happening. The clutch is spinning? Yes, at 44,000 RPM. Dump it. <laughs> what the fuck? Was that 0 to 60 in like 0.2 seconds? I'm actually curious to see how fast it is, so... Oh, how convenient, there's a straight here. So we now have the 0 to 100 kilometers per hour timer in the corner. I don't know how this works. But yeah, let's see. Okay now, fuck you. Let's try that again. It's not that fast. Yeah, th this makes no sense. At this point, you don't even have to like shift gears. Like, I can actually live on first gear. Of course, my brakes can't. <laughs> They're fading like crazy now. Like French cars. And look at it uphill. Damn. Sh 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 Wait a second. Do you want to go off-road? I don't know. Let's ask the Discord server. Yeah, I think the answer is pretty clear. Holy sh- <laughs> oh, I forgot AI cars went off-road too. Likely the Roma isn't that bad at off-roading. Look at this fast boy. Dump it. <laughs> this is just so stupid. Yes, that was a crash, so we now have 88,000 RPM. And this pessima vuole le botte, cazzo. Ma cosa fanno? Ma perché? Ma vi levate dal cazzo? <laughs> and with an RPM increase, of course, comes a power increase. 4,700 horsepower. And it sounds... I don't even know. It just stops sounding different. Ah, did it just pull off a wheelie? I'm curious. Dump it. I hate asking for likes, but I'm doing it right now, so... Since I've already started plugging stuff, make sure also to subscribe. Anyways, back to... Not going off-road? Oh yes! I think we've turned it into a lowrider. Yeah, it is pretty fucked up, but I'm surprised it still drives. Like, this boy went through a lot. <laughs> yeah, it drives actually pretty nicely. Yeah, in theory, we do now have almost 200,000 RPM. I'm actually gonna do a top speed run and some drag races in a second, but I, I just want to see how it sounds when you push it to the limit. So we're finally on tarmac and ignoring the wide curvet behind us, I'm gonna stop here. Actually, no. <laughs> the game is actually dying now. Anyways, after all this, we can finally hear how it sounds. Pretty good. I mean, it, it's ah! Holy shit! All right, top speed run. Don't beat. And we are getting speed quick. <laughs> Just look at the exhaust, bruh. Yeah, we do have quite the wheel spin. Four hundred. Yes. What does this feel comfortable? 
It is pretty hard to keep it straight. This is not gonna be easy, so... Steering is rather off. Three thirty. I am gonna do it. Time for a drag race. <laughs> We're both very stable, as you can see. Ah, uh, yeah, he got us. Let's go. Holy shit! I don't even know what the f happened. Reverse. First gear. Let's go. Far. Yes. 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 Come on. Well, that's pretty good. And now, if I feel like it, I'm gonna leave you with a nice compilation of clutch dumps. Otherwise, I'm gonna end the video now. Oh, meu Deus.